Only four more sleeps until the Logie Awards right here on Channel 7 and going for gold, our very own Sonia Kruger, the entertainer and presenter from The Voice, Dancing with the Stars and Big Brother is up for the biggest award of the night. She's also co-hosting the Logie's Red Carpet Show alongside Dr Chris Brown. It's going to be good. I'm really glad you're here. Really? Absolutely. Got this cavoodle, and I think it's a urinary tract infection. <laughs> <laughs> TV's Night of Nights kicks off Sunday from 7 pm live from the Star Sydney. And Anya Sonia Kruger <laughs> joins us right now. Good morning to you. Um, morning, this Anya Shevo. Sonia campaign to get you a well, gold yeah. Logie has taken off. Well, you guys started it for yeah. me. It was well, Barrett's, Barrett's. No, well, it, initially I think it was Sam Mack at oh. the Logie's Breakfast, but Barrett's has really taken on it on board, and he is now managing it. Yeah. Um, I noticed that you're not wearing yours, which is a little disappointing. Uh, but, you know, I, we were going to, Look, and it's the, well, the, the studio crew. Floor. See, the crew have got them on. Mitch and Ben, or, you know, Audio, yeah. Julia, who's our PA. Obviously, they are committed. <laughs> yes, not saying that you guys aren't, but they are very committed to the cause. Look at we, that angle. We are. We've just got to do some serious stuff after this, so we'll, okay, oh, we'll right. put it on after <laughs> that. It wouldn't quite work for an in interview with the Prime Minister. Exactly, no. yeah. exactly. Um, so, tell us... Uh, the red carpet. Yes. We know you're the queen of it. Chris Brown, how do we feel about him on the red carpet? <laughs> oh, well, do you know what? I actually think Chris, he's, he says he's colour blind for a start. Yes. So that's a funny thing. Like, how yes. will he, will he be asking me, like, what colour is that dress? Yeah. But I think Chris has an innate eye for fashion and a, a secret sort of penchant for a bit of fashion. If you've oh, ever watched really? him on TV, he does like yeah. to sport some nice looks himself. So yeah. I think he's going to look very dashing on the night. Yes. And uh, and also, we won't just be talking to these people, obviously, about, about what they're wearing, but it's no. also about mm. what they're nominated for and, you know, any behind-the-scenes gossip that we can get out of them. It's like the Oscars, you know. It's much yes. more than just what people are wearing. What pets they have. That's right. Yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. He's actually a very good photographer too, Chris. Isn't Takes some great photos. Yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, How do you good. know so that? And must, neither of us know I that. I stalk yeah. him. No. You stalk uh, him. He must be. He Weirdo. must be able to see some sort of colour because he's a very good photographer. No, this is this is a, this is something that's new. Matt Shevington is stalking Chris, Dr. Chris Brown on Instagram. He stalks me too. Listen, don't he, he's my one follower. Are you, has he slid into your DMs yet? This is a question. I'm not going to say. Do you know what? For real life, though. One of our first dogs, Jess and I, he was our vet, like legitimate vet. Oh, was he? Yeah, when and it was you a paid pup. him money. Yes, that's right. We did it early on. He is yeah. a legitimate yeah. vet. Yeah. He helped build his career. Yeah, he yeah, yeah, fixed yeah. my dog's urinary tract infection, yeah, so that's all good. <laughs> okay. It's, it's those glands at the back end you've got to watch out for. <laughs> I'm just something completely different because people are Sorry, trying to we eat digress. Yeah. <laughs> We've seen some gorgeous photos this week of your mum's birthday. Her yes, age. mum turned 80, and it's really funny because, you know, she, I don't, look, I don't think my mum looks 80. She rides a bike sort of two days a week, you know, two, twice a day around a lake at home. Her elder sister is 100. So I think mum is going to be with us for quite a bit longer. But it was lots of fun. We had it up on the Gold Coast and yeah. everyone had a really, really good time. Well... This is the funniest thing. She requested a party bus for all of her mates. <laughs> and I'm like, hey, how lit are these 80-year-olds going to get at this party that they need a bus, yeah, right? Yeah, the And she was boys. right, wasn't she? Yeah, they did yeah. have a good time. <laughs> um, any insight into what you're going to be wearing? Because you always look amazing on the red carpet. Yeah. Well, th this year... I actually, it's really funny because people have been saying to me, if you're hosting the red carpet and then you're going in as a Gold Logie nominee, you have to get changed. And oh. I was like, no, I don't know. What do you mean? From out, uh, from, from doing the doing show? The hosting really? To going inside. And I'm like, but why would I do that? No, no, you have to because this is your opportunity to get, to get, to wear two dresses. And oh. in actual fact, there, we have two amazing Australian designers who have put together the outfits and um, Stephen Khalil is doing the red carpet oh. outfit. Okay. Um, I can't reveal the other one just yet, but... But Stephen is an amazing designer, and it's it's really really yeah. it's a really beautiful dress. So I, I just had images of Blake Lively, Met Gala a couple of years oh, back, right. where she transformed. Well, she transformed a transformer. That's what outfit. I'm thinking. Yes. Yeah, and then you could transform it for the after party, mm. and it would mm. automatically have. Javiana's uh, down yeah. here. Right? <laughs> I, 
I got papped at the airport wearing Havianas oh, the other day, you? coming back from Bali. Oh, I love that. So w good. Woman of the people. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> in my thong. Absolutely. We often back say that Bali. about you, Son. Yeah. yeah, keep wearing your thongs. We can't wait to see, because it's going to be great. Mm. It is. It's going to be big. I feel there's a buzz. There's a there real is. buzz yeah. Yeah. the ladies yeah. this year. It's back. It's, yeah. yeah, definitely. 100%. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you so Don't much. need it, though. You can vote now for Sonia Kruger to win the gold Logie. Head to tvweeklogies.com.au and all the action kicks off on Sunday at 7 p.m. That's this Sunday, 7 p.m. on Channel 7 and 7 Plus. Anya, Sonia, thanks for joining us. Thank you, guys.